satisfied to, and honored to be with Lova because they have a long tradition and they really do amazing good mountaineering boots. And I'm especially there to the technical mountain boots for test them before they pr product and get it final. So we really can go to Jetzendorf and it's a small good team and they also produce the shoes in Europe and not in Asia. So they really have the chance to react kind of fast and really um, listen to our wishes. Uh, if it has to be a thinner sole or a better climbing sole or we like to have a shoe to zip or to tie it on with, a, with a, the new screw. So this is really kind of good, it's like a long tradition and also if you have a team meeting with the whole team, we have Hans, Hans Kammerlander and team who climbs with these shoes since 20, 40 years, or Stefan Glovac and Robert Jasper and Ines Papert and David Göttler and it's really amazing. So it's a big competence which comes together when we have a meeting about shoes and many, many crazy discussion, but at the end they really do step by step and if they do something they do it for real and it's really wet. they wait and long enough until the product really is good enough for us and this is cool you really feel like you work for a company or you test for a company they understand the mountaineering and how you do real good mountain boots. Metanoia is for me a big adventure and the biggest alp climb winter climb I've done in the Alps. I have a new project it's a long dream of mine I travel around the world since 20 years and I climbed a lot in Himalaya, a lot in Alaska, a lot in Patagonia and but I'm on the best place to climb and to do mountaineering, that's the Alps and for me it's really important that I also climb more often in the Alps because we have the best climbs, the biggest wall, the finest rock climbing routes and also to show a little bit to my younger climber, we don't have to fly all the time around the world to be in a good shape, to be a good climber and mountaineer and it's, there are so many real good classic routes, they have rare second ascents or only a couple of and because you're a professional mountaineer these days it almost gets easier to organize an expedition for six or eight weeks then you're out but I want to take this time and climb a lot the next two seasons in the Alps with other pro climbers, but also with young friends, with old friends, especially with local people. So from east to west, I want to start far away in Triglav and climb all the Alps through, through Dolomites, through the Swiss Alps, through the French Alps, through the Austrian Alps, also here in Berchtesgaden and down to the Sea Alps, Chamonix. And I know so many people around this whole Alp range that I'm really looking forward to met the right people and you know they know where when the conditions are really good and which route are actual. And there is a big good um, adventure looking uh, I'm looking forward because of hard climbs but also for time have fun with good people and sharing this dream. So it's a it's a long dream of mine and I don't wanna do this in a hurry. I don't wanna speed up. It's not something I go for a record. So it, it, I want to have this on a high, high quality and over after two seasons I want to collect the 50 best climbs and try to share them with other friends, with other people, with local people, with touristic places or if there are nice stories, storytelling and stuff. So it really has to be, this is my project, it's a big, big project, but there is a lot of potential to, to share it with people for climber or for people like you. For my personal uh, representation, I choose the format of a magazine because I'm not a big book reader. I often look more magazines and I get inspired by the Alpinist magazines years ago. And now I had the chance to write my stories around the world down in a magazine with kind of big pictures and with not so much uh, written texts. I often about the Eiger, but also from America, Yosemite and Patagonia, wherever. And this summer I'm working on a second edition and it's the name called Passion Eiger and I have climbed 25 different routes and in this magazine there are only Eiger climbs. And the local um, production, the Entlebucher Medienhaus where I've grown up, they have a special new app. So you can up 
uh, some pictures on it and behind it pops up a video from some climbs or some more pictures. So this is something new that really we fit together and we can support each other. So the, this newspaper, this regional media house and my climbs on the Eiger and this will be this summer. This will be realized this summer, yeah.